Hello, I'm Drone Pin and welcome back to my let's play of Dismantle, where of course in the last episode we came up to this northern bit here and we managed to make it over and find the Polaris key that was in this fortified cabin. I actually just kind of stumbled across it by accident. Uh, we've come back here and opened this Polaris gate and we'll go in there. I think first things first though, we'll sleep at the campfire, we'll go up there and activate the link tower. And then someone has said in the comments, I'll say I, I am recording these ahead of time so I'm quite a few episodes ahead of you guys. Um, but someone said this obelisk down here that we did the uh, challenge in, I have to actually activate it and then I get like a perk or something from it. So I didn't know that. I thought the activate was just, oh, you could do it again or something. So um, yeah, I'll have to go back there and activate that because we'll get some kind of perk or something. So let's do that. Let's sleep at this campfire first, though. I think that is the first port of call. And we got a level. Yeah, we got a level. So that's good. I think we might have got two or three levels, actually. Uh, so what do we want? Scavenger, I'm kind of leaning towards that one. Hmm. Yeah, I think the scavenger. Let's go with that and then we should yet yeah, get another one. I think maybe turret specialist just because we haven't really used the turret. Builder might be good, but the fighter would also be really good just for the extra damage. Hmm. I'm going to go fighter. I'm going fighter. Let's do that. Uh, I don't think we're going to do any upgrades because we're waiting for a mana shard and then some titanium there. So, um, yeah. Uh, the katana as well. We need some titanium. I guess if we're doing a just a, a round and about trip, we should probably just go back to the smelters and set those off again. Um, that's probably a good idea, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, I think it probably is. I don't see any reason not to do that. Yeah, because we can't really do anything. Everything else is like titanium and stuff we need. So, yeah, let's do that. Let's just kind of... Can we sleep? Yeah, let's sleep. We'll get a health boost. And then I, re I guess really we should actually have waste not wasted that sleep. We should have wasted it. Used it when we're going into this Polaris place. So, oh well, never mind. Let's get cracking anyway. Slept for the campfire, campfire 148 times. Oh, also somebody wanted me to show... Where are we? Uh, my progress as well um, so there you go uh, so we've got 54% medals we've got main quest is 41% holy moly okay well I guess we're doing 100 episodes of this or something uh, side quest yeah we've been knocking those out uh, there's a few of those that we haven't finished yet but uh, that would add a few points to that points of interest as well I'm going to guess that's the places you've been to so we've only been to 35% yeah okay right well there you go um Never mind. Right, let's try and cut here and we'll uh, we'll try and ignore as many of these guys as possible. Uh, as I say, they have respawned, so we'll just kind of uh, sneak our way up here as best as we can. We'll have to take a few people out, but that's fine. And we'll go and disable the thing, and then we'll be able to do a fast travel from it as well. So, um, yeah, I think that's definitely the way to go. Let's come over to here, and then we should be able to install the eye orb thing. Transmitters, deadly transmission. Yeah, I've got three of those, so that's good. There we are. Now everyone should uh, should do that. And then let's travel back down to... Oh, bollocks, not to there. <laughs> to the other place. <laughs> okay, right. Not to here, though the smelter is... Yeah. Oh, ooh, hang on. Is this... Hang on. Yeah, no. Well, we may as well... I was going to come here anyway, so... Yeah, we may as well go here now. I was going to go and activate that thing first, but eh, it doesn't matter. Uh, I'm going to leave the farm because I'm just not that bothered about it. Ooh, can we break? Ah, okay. Oh, like everything, man. It's so bloody close. That is just... Yeah, that is the story so far, isn't it? We are so close to upgrading. Uh, we've probably got a bit of steel. Should we make like 20? Yeah, let's make 20. Why not? And then we'll make as much steel as we can as well. There we go. Let's do that. And then the lumber. Hmm. I guess I'll make some lumber, but I'm not that bothered. I, I feel like we're doing okay with it. Ah, we don't know. We don't have any plant matter. Yeah, that's something we're really hurting on. So I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna leave that one. I'm not sure whether the lumber is quite so bad as the. Uh, it seems a lot easier to get hold of. So yeah, that's all right. Let's drop this off here. Can drop that in there. Yeah, we don't have enough. Uh, we don't have enough for that. But we need the mana shard anyway. But we'll try and get the katana or the the sledgehammer. I'd kind of like the sledgehammer to do some more smashing. But you know, 
uh, whatever, whatever comes first, uh, we'll do that. Let's now fast travel back down to this place down here. I did not mean to click on that, but that's okay. That's where I wanted to go as well. So, you know, no harm, no foul. Oh, crap. That's the Everglades. Oh, damn it. <laughs> oh, God. I'm all over the shop. At least this doesn't cost me anything. Uh, it's this place, Serpent's Crossing. There we go. That's good. Right, let's run to this obelisk, and then apparently I could activate some kind of boost or something. So let's get over there. Okay, right, here we are. We're at the obelisk, so let's go with that. Oh, okay, so we've got 5% heat protection. Only one ob obelisk can be activated at the same... active at the same time. Ah, right. So probably the obelisk is the thing that's going to get me north with the heat. Ah... Okay, so that's giving me heat protection, which is fine. I mean, I'll activate it. We may as well. Um, and there we go. We finished the uh, mystery as well. I never actually finished that. I thought it had finished and I had to go and do another one. But yeah, so I'm going to guess one of these obelisks is going to give me... Uh, where have we got? We've got one somewhere. Where is one? Oh boy, there's one. One of these is going to give me... A, uh, oh, there's a quest there as well. Interesting. Um, it's going to give me the uh, cold protection. Hmm. Okay, so... Yeah, I don't know which one it is, but one of them is going to give me the cold protection. I only guess probably one in the north. That would kind of make sense. Have we found one in the north? I don't think so. Okay, so we're going to have to find an obelisk in the north somewhere. Oh boy, okay. Alright, well, let's go back anyway and we'll go into that other thing. Um, we'll uh, start the Polaris thing off. Let's do that anyway. And uh, we'll worry about that later. Okay, so here we are. We're back at Polaris. I actually didn't think about it, but I'd have thought the uh, being down in that um, jungle area would have uh, made me uh, too hot because I'm wearing all this hot weather gear. But, oh well, never mind. It didn't. Let's break this up and we'll get some more metal and all that stuff. And do we really want to kill you? We do have something that I want to search in there. Can't break this yet, can I? Yeah, 70. Everything's bloody 75, man. Damn it. <laughs> Everything is 75. Uh, let's put down a landmine. We'll get this clown to follow us. There we go. And you dead. Nice. Oh, there's a couple of things to search in there. Let's do that. Yeah, because I'm running into cold problems. And I'm going to guess that's what's going to get me... That 5% might be what gets me past uh, that. And we can go and get the fuel cell. Interesting. Okay. Well, that's cool. Uh, we definitely need all the metal. That's probably the thing we need the most. I think I feel like the wood is probably doing okay on. Um, don't really want that. What is that? Oh, yeah. That's some more metal as well. Uh, we'll do some more smashing. I'd like to get this uh, thing. Ooh, hello. Let's kill you off. So, yeah. Everyone's going to be back and uh, drop mana beads. Did he drop a mana bead? He probably did. I just didn't notice it. Um, yeah. So, that's good. So, we open that gate. So, we'll go back in there. And you dead as well. Yeah, if you didn't spend all the time screaming, we, you could have possibly done something then. But never mind, you had to scream, so, you know. Oh, so close to taking a bin out in one here as well. Oh, damn, man. Right. Uh, yeah, it's getting cold again. Uh, where is the thing? Over here somewhere. Oh, it's going to kill you off as well. That's great. Uh, we might run into heat issues, actually, in here as well, mightn't we? Oh, cold issues. Yeah, okay. Well, we'll see how we do anyway, but yeah, we may run into some cold issues here and we may have to divert and go somewhere else. That could be that could be what we have to do. And maybe head into the south and do uh, some of the quests down there. I've got a thing to um, oh, was it like find a lost convoy or something in the desert, uh, which seemed like it was across the river. So yeah, maybe something like that we might have to go and do. Let's just go and drop all that off now whilst we can. And then we'll come in here. As I say, we may... Oh. Okay, a crater. Something has fallen in here. Uh, what the hell are they doing with it? Oh, that's probably the uh, meteorite thing, wasn't it? That they were, we had. I can feel the mana affecting me. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, that was like the uh, meteorite thing, wasn't it? That fell to the ground. So, yeah. That's probably what that was. Yeah, we're getting some, like, time slowdown or something. Fair enough. Ooh. Uh, let's switch over to the axe because that does do better damage. 
There we go, we killed you. That's fine. Took a few hits, but never mind. Uh, guard staff game night uh, this Friday. Bring your D20s. <laughs> okay. They're playing some uh, Dungeons and Dragons by the sounds of it. Uh, okay. Search that. Take a bit of fabric. Search that. Take some circuit boards. Break a load of that up as well. Yeah, the metal I think is more than the uh, more than the wood. Uh, the wood's still going to be useful, obviously, but uh, we definitely want the metal. I think. Uh, yeah, coal. We may we may not be able to do this. I'm kind of worried that we might not be able to do it because of the coal problems. We may have to backtrack and find, go and do something else, or try and find one of those uh, obelisks that will give us a boost in um, coal protection or something. I don't really want to do that because I don't know where they're going to be. That's really going to slow us down. But yeah, okay, all right. Yeah, I'm feeling like we might not be able to do this. Oh, that sucks. Okay. All right, well, let's let's lose the heat, and then we'll go back north. But I don't think I'm going to be able to do it. I think we're going to have to possibly backtrack and go somewhere else. Uh, we'll have to look at some of the quests in a minute, but let's go up there and just kill this guy anyway. Um, but yeah, I think we're I think we're kind of screwed on this one. That is a shame. Uh, I don't know. Maybe we can skirt around it, but yeah, have we got the? Yeah, we've got the hot water bottle. I think that five percent extra would just do it. So what are we at? Forty three, and we can only take thir We can only take forty five. Yes, or forty. So if we had a buff of five percent of five degrees, which is I assume what the cold protection would be, we could make it with that obelisk. And I'm gonna guess probably where the um where the one in the south is, the fuel cell. You're probably gonna need that one. So maybe we should head south. Yeah, maybe we should do that. Let's kill this guy though. Oh, I love that thing though. That is so good that it's just stun. That's just really good. I'm going to push as far as I can, though. Now it's going up and down. Stay on your designated path and follow your supervisor. Avoid any unnecessary contact with the soil. You can carry approved uh, items in or out of the facility. Only carry approved items. Okay, uh, maybe we'll be okay. I don't know. We're... Oh, well. Okay. Well, we're in and out with that now. So let's push in. I, I don't want to go if I can help it. Can we shoot this thing? That's so handy, that thing. Yeah, that rifle's brilliant. I like it. I mean, you only get seven shots, but still. That is really good. Yeah. Let's say we're going to run into cold issues, so... Let's just push. Let's just push. And see if we can make it, because we're kind of in and out of the zone here, so... I feel like we might be okay. <laughs> We might just be able to skirt around it. But I don't know. We'll see. Does it make any difference if we get inside as well? Hmm. I don't know. Let's find out. Oh boy! Okay. File out. Single file. And let me shoot you. There we go. Right, where the hell is that thing? Right, can we shoot that? Gun. I don't think I can hit that. Yeah, okay. Alright. Hmm. All right, if I run there, let's break this thing down. Take that down, that's great. And then if I run back out the door, get the rifle out, I might be able to snipe it from here. Ah. Is there any way of just cancelling that? Yeah, okay, just move, that's fine. Hmm. I had a perfect shot on it a second ago, but yeah, I don't think I can get it. Oh, man. No. Ah, damn it. Alright, let's run in here. Get away from it if we can. Uh, I wonder if I can break through the door or the wall. I wonder if I just break through the wall, actually. Ah, no, I can't either. All right, um, kind of cheese it and throw a grenade at it. Oh boy. No. Oh, damn it. Oh, I, all right, I'll take it. Oh. That's not what I wanted. 
Alright, well, you come this way and then that gets rid of you. That's great. <clears throat> I wonder if I can just run behind it. Damn it. Oh, that did nothing? Really? What? Ugh. Okay, well, not quite, but there we go. <laughs> oh dear. Alright, well, let's get back there. Okay, right, here we are. We're back. Let's get in there. Oh, yeah, I can loot all my stuff. I was just thinking, what's that to loot? Let's just loot it all. Wait for it to look north, and I'm going to chuck a knife at it and see if that's easier. No. Okay, that's not easy at all. Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, it's got full health again. Damn it. Uh. All right, let's see if there's a way around. Let's see if there's a way around that. Oh, there's a bloody there's a bloody campfire here. <laughs> yep. Shout out me in the comments for that one. <laughs> yep, that, that was dumb. I suspect I can go around that thing. I'm gonna take in the pig-headed approach on that one. All right, let's drop that in there. Let's go. And then there's got to be a way around that thing. Got to be a way around it. Smash some stuff. As, yeah, otherwise that's kind of impossible. I guess I could put the camo net in on actually. That is a camouflage thing, isn't it? But oh my god! Okay, there's a what? What the hell? Hmm. I kind of have a feeling I'm not supposed to be here. I get the feeling I'm not supposed to be here yet, and I need some more equipment. Uh, you know. I, I feel like that's a that's a thing. Um, so what is it? Temperature. It's in the fort. We just on the border of it. So okay. Let's take that out. We'll put the camo netting in and see whether that kind of helps me. I don't know if that'll affect. That's possibly just these guys and not the guns. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. No, that's just a auto shot thing. That is. Yeah, I can't snipe it. Okay, yeah, that should... Um, hmm. I wonder if I could just outrun those those rockets. Hmm. Well, there's a spawn point there, isn't there? Yeah, bollocks to it. Let's go. Let's do it. Uh. There we go. Kind of a panic, but there we are. We did it. Ugh. Dude. There we go. It worked. Please, would you shut up? There we go. Yeah, just run it. <laughs> There's always a way. I, I suspect that is not what I had in, in, in mind, but there we go. Just run around and it, it can't target you. There we go. I played a few games in my time. <laughs> I learned a few things. Yeah, there we go. Just cheese it. That's always the way to go. Oh damn, that's a good that's a good bit of cheese though, isn't it? Can we break this thing? Oh, that's gotta be steel. That's gotta be steel. Oh yeah, that's steel. Nice. That's good. I like it. I like me some steel. That is good. Um, right, let's let's use the bandage again. I already had the bandage out. Let's use the bandage again. That'll heal us right back up again. That's great. And then we should come up behind that um, behind that gun. Hopefully, there's going to be more of them though. So there we are. Our lock pick. That's great. Uh, we also need the uh, master one as well. That's something else we need. I really want this thing to get just get that last bit of upgrade, and then we can smash a lot of st a lot more stuff up. Uh, that'd be fantastic. Uh, ooh, there's a quest there. Interesting. Let's go in here. Uh, let's read this board. Uh, consult Doctor James about the blue rock instability issue. I'm not sending anyone else into that tunnel of death. 
Hmm. Okay, well, I guess I'm going into the Tunnel of Death. Oh, there's a gun out there. I wonder if we should try and take that out. Probably should do. Read uh, test results point to uh, tells of redacted collapse in redacted weeks. Recommended immediate redacted of redacted. Okay. Or redacted there. Right. Should we try and take that gun out with the rifle? I think we should. Yeah, if we get a clear shot, they're taking these things out, it's easy. That's good. I'm going to switch back to the the dice, I think. I like the uh, critical hit chance. So let's go with that. Oh boy. Okay. So let's go with a gun again. Have we got any ammo for that? Yes, we have. I don't know if there's... I can't see the gun or where it is, so... Right, there we go. Let's spin the camera around. No. Did that get it? Yes, it did. Nice. There we go. We just took them out. Brilliant. Ooh, there's a... Ooh, there's like a nuclear reactor or something? Okay. That's a thing, I guess. Uh, let's break through here. We'll probably get back to the... Uh, back to where we just were. Okay. Um, maybe not. Ooh, can we take this guy out? I'm going to take this guy out. I don't mind the others. They're relatively weak source, so... Oh, we got the stun. I'll have to check what the percentage chance of that is, but it's not all the time. Obviously, it'd be way too OP, but... Um, that gun. Can I sneak up on it? Let's go. Hey, <laughs> there we are. Brilliant. Ooh, tractor. Can I take that apart? No. Fair enough. Right, there we are. And then we're back round to the front. Let's break through this way as well. And we'll go and drop everything off. I think I probably... I'm thinking maybe sleeping. Getting the gun reacted again. Because that's been really good against those turrets. So yeah, I'm kind of leaning towards that. Yeah, let's do that. Did I pick titanium up then? I just dropped something that was purple off. I don't know. I didn't notice it though. Let's just rest. And we'll leave again because nobody should respawn, so we should be good there. So that's good. The respawns are all shut down. Yep, fantastic. That's brilliant. Right. Let's make our way into this place. You're trapped in there, so screw you, buddy. Uh, let's take apart all these pipes because we do want the steel. Uh, we definitely want the steel, so let's take apart all of these pipes. Wow, there's a lot here, isn't there? There's all these mine carts as well. Damn, yeah, there's a lot of metal here. I'm going to have to break a lot of this up, I think. I think we're going to have to break a lot of this. There's just there's too much here. It's mostly metal, which is really what we need. I, say, I, don't, I don't feel like the wood. I'm that struggling for it. I'm, I'm sure I will do at some point, but at the moment, I feel like the metal is what we need to prioritise more than the uh, more than the wood. Like, you know, I just don't think that's that bad at the moment. But obviously, I'm sure that will change. So let's break this up. Break that up as well. Just kind of change the camera slightly. There we are. Yeah, there's a lot of metal here, isn't there? There's so much metal here. Uh, let's take. Let's check this uh, quest anyway. Start the fabricator. Use the fabricator to fabricate an item. Fabricators can be used to uh, create items directly from materials. <gasps> Ooh. Does that mean I can make one of those? Wow. Okay, right. Well, let's... Start the fabricator. Fabricate old pocket watch. Fine-tuned uh, clock that marks the passing of time. There's those time modifiers. 25%. So it makes things run slower? Am I, am I reading that correctly? Alright, well... Let's do it, I guess. 
He wants me to fabricate an item, so. Uh, fine tuned clock that marks the passing of time. The mechanism seems flawless but actually runs slow. Okay, so does that mean time moves slower? There we go. So. Alright, I'm going to guess I'm going to get some more items at some point. Ooh, what's on this table? Redacted uh, can, can affect flow of redacted and could theoretically be used as redacted. Okay. A lot of redacted in here. So close to being able to smash some of this stuff in one hit. Oh, well, there we go. That was a little hit of uh, XP. So, hmm. I guess we should install that thing and just see what it actually does. Um, I wonder if the shoelace, we might want to take that off. Mm. We'll see. Uh, so let's put this thing on. So does that just mean the time moves slower or something? I don't know. I don't know what that's supposed to do. Yeah, I feel like I'm moving slower now. I guess that's going to be handy at some point, but I don't think I need it. Yeah, I'm just moving a bit slower by the looks of it. Is it me or I'm just running slower? Yeah. My initial thoughts was I'm not liking it, so I'm going back to the dies. Yeah. Yeah, it feels like everything's moving a little bit slower. I guess there's going to be a point to that at some point. We're going to need it, but right now I'm just going to leave it as is. Kind of got used to the combat, so... I don't, I don't want to do anything. Yeah, I need all this steel, so I'm going to break up all of this for the steel. Because uh, we want the titanium to start flowing. Uh, that's really what I say. I think the I think the metal is what we're hurting on the most. That's what we need to do. We have to take some time to smash everything up. But yeah, that's part and parcel of the game. So you know, uh, we'll break. Oh, there's a smelter there as well. Um, John, I'm just gonna set that off while I'm here. Uh, not usable men. Monsters are nearby. Oh, okay. Hey, we got you, dude. Alright, now we got you. That's cool. Yeah, that's good. So... Oh, we can break that as well. I can't break through that though, yeah. I didn't think so. Uh, right, can I use that or is that the gun counted as a monster? Yes, I can. Brilliant. Right. Well, I say we fabricate as much titanium as we can. Set that off, we'll put the wood in. There we go. And then by the time we've finished smashing this place up, we'll have enough for the katana. And we can get another upgrade on that because that's going to be useful. We're starting to encounter multiple enemies, so uh, that could be just a decent weapon uh, to go with. So we'll go with that. Yeah, there's just tons of metal here. It's just like almost everything is made out of metal. I think we might just have to do smashy smashy. That might be the name of this episode, is Smashy Smashy, we just didn't really get anywhere, but there we go. It's got to be done, so, you know, it's just the name of the game. Dismantle, we've got to dismantle everything. Okay, right, we've got all the steel bearing components out of here, so I think if we go in here and round this way, we might be able to sneak up on, what the hell's that? Oh, it's a bird's nest. Yeah, okay, uh, we might be able to sneak up on that gun, we might not, I have no idea, but, you know. Let's just do it though. We'll get in here anyway. Uh, I don't think there's much in here, so the locker room, shower room, yeah, nothing in there. That's fine. Right, so this thing may just open up on us, I've no idea. Uh, I'm going to get ready to throw a grenade at it. Nope, we got it. There we go, that's it. Trying to take it head on was just stupid, but there we go. I was just being pig headed, <laughs> as usual. Hello? One. Two. And just wait for them to come round the corner. Three. Line them up and knock them down. There we go. Uh, I think these were just iron, right? Yeah, well, it's actually it was a decent chunk of stuff, wasn't it? Yeah, we've got enough to upgrade the katana as well, so we'll, we'll do that in a minute as well. Uh... We can take you down almost. 
sledgehammer to the face. It's like I'm playing seven days to die or something. Right, there we go. Let's search that. Grab some onions. Gather that's just going to be spice. Gather that's just going to be spice again. I think we're into the mess hall, so just probably going to be food for the most part. Looks like a fridge, so yeah, more food. Food and rubber. Okay, all right. That's, yeah. Don't really agree with that. Rice as well. Yeah, we did find rice, didn't we? So that's something else we're going to have to go and plant. Ah, oh, bollocks. I should have gone to the farm and planted some rice. Damn it. I totally forgot about that. Oh, well. Never mind. No, this is just iron, isn't it? There we go. Right. I think we've cleared this place. Oh, no. What's else in there? Oh, it's just spice again, yeah. And some of that here. Okay, that's fine. I don't think there's much else in here, but let's just check it out. Go this way. Ooh, what's that? Oh, God. Hello. Redacted. The end cakes are redacted. Uh, sent another complaint about the sample quality. Uh, remind them that it's not our fault. Uh, the redacted keeps malfunctioning. Dr. Carter. Okay. Oh, really? Come on, mate. There you go. You've worked it out. Look at you, eh? Well done. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. Isn't it? You know. Well done. You worked it out in the end. You did not seem to want to get out of there, but yeah, you got there in the end. Uh, not much there either. We could probably could have come that way to the gun as well. Right, there we go. Brilliant. So, I feel like we've probably uh, done enough here. Let's move on. Oh, God. There we go. Uh, which way do we... Oh. Oh, the tunnel is collapsed. Okay, read. Keep mining equipment secured at all times. Always wear a hard hat. Any M-Class event must be reported to the tele the temporarily closed over closed it oh, closest overseer i'll get my words out all ah, right so that is that facility there hmm i guess we got to hmm how the hell do we get to that maybe we have to kind maybe we have to continue round yeah possibly should have done that uh, there's some stuff over here as well let's just go and check that quickly before we move out of here I think there was just a few enemies or something. Oh boy. It's old explodey guy. Screw you, buddy. Come on. Yeah, you dead. Some wolves about, but not much else. Oh, there's a there's a way over. I didn't notice that. Fair enough. Uh, there's a repairable bridge over there as well. Interesting. Let's go back. Oh, or you could just run around it and it completely bypass the gas. Okay. But never mind. There we are. Drop that down. That's great. So we can just uh, get out there. So we want to fast travel. We can come over this side as well and just uh, do that. That's brilliant. Let's go and drop all this stuff off back in the box. And then we'll go back down to the crater and try and skirt circle round. Uh, yeah. I'm going to have to do some smashing as well. But I, I'm feeling that certainly to get to the fuel cell, we're going to need that obelisk. And we're going to need a specific one that d gives us the heat buff. Uh, you know, or that makes us warm. So, you know, helps us deal with uh, cold weather. So, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, look at that bar fly up. Yeah, I can't do it. Okay, I'm gonna beat a retreat. I think this was, uh, you know. So we got to go and find one of those obelisks. I mean, I guess the probably the best thing to do, as we have the heat one, is probably to go for this one, isn't it? And we might stumble across the obelisk that helps us out. I would assume that the obelisk that helps you out is in one of these cold zones, given that that one was in a heat zone that we found. I, that that would be my thinking is that it's in a hot zone, it's in a cold zone, so the obelisk is maybe there. We've explored quite a bit of that, but not all of it. Then this one, this one here, I don't. Th I think I just came in and shut the thing down, and that was it. I don't think I did anything other than shut the shut the thing down. That was it, or just go and explore it. I don't think I shut the thing down at all. So, yeah, we'll have to explore some of these cold zones. Maybe we'll push into this one and have a look in there. Hmm. 
yeah, anyway, I think for now, I think this is a good place to call it, and I think we'll end the episode here, and then we'll decide what to do in the next one. I'm not too sure. Um, oh, let's kill this guy as well. You were hanging out there all on your own. There we go. Right, so yeah, as I say for now, I think this is where I'm going to call it anyway, and I'm going to end the episode. So if you like that one, please give me a thumbs up, comment your thoughts down below, subscribe for more. I really do appreciate it. Stay safe out there, everyone, and I'll catch you next time.